Hello, and thank you for your interest in Decipher iPhone tools. This is just a quick video to show you how to get started using Decipher text message to copy the text messages from your iPhone to your computer. I'm starting the video at the window that you would see after downloading Decipher text message for Mac. In order to install the software, I'm just going to drag the application into my Applications folder. Then if I close the window and open Finder, I should see Decipher text message listed under my applications on my Mac. Decipher text message copies the SMS messages onto your computer from the iTunes backup files. So if it's been a while since the last time that you backed up your iPhone in iTunes, you're going to want to do that before running the software. So if I open iTunes, I can make a backup of my iPhone by right-clicking on the iPhone under Devices and selecting Backup. Now, if I run Decipher text message, at first I'll see a small window showing the list of backups that Decipher text messages read. Then, in the larger window, I'll see a list of all of my different iPhone devices that Decipher text messages read backups for. If I select one of the devices, I'll see a list of all of my different SMS conversations with all the different recipients. When I click on a specific recipient, I'll see a list of the SMS conversation that I've had with that recipient. In addition to seeing text messages, you also see all the different MMS attachments between you and that contact. For example, I have a little picture of my dog that my husband sent me. So if I click on that picture, Decipher text message will use whatever the default application on your computer for viewing that kind of file is. So for example, since this is a picture, my Mac opens it with preview. If I scroll all the way down to the bottom, I also have a video attachment, and if I click on that, it opens up appropriately in QuickTime Player. In addition to just being able to view your messages within the application, you can also use a save feature to save various conversations, uh, either the current conversation, a specific set, or all the conversations uh, on a specific device or in the entire application. So if I select to save the current conversation, I'm going to specify that I want to save the conversation to my desktop. And then Decipher Text Message will make a little folder on my desktop for the conversation between my iPhone 4 and the recipient. Inside of that folder, you'll see a small HTML file sort of showing the conversation in the same way it's formatted within the application. Additionally, you'll have a folder of all of your different attachments so that if you want to grab the full-size version of pictures and things like that and videos, uh, you have them all saved in a convenient spot. If you ever have any problems with the software, you can click on the Help button and it will open a little web page showing you our frequently asked questions and a link to contact us on our web page. Thank you very much for watching this video to show you how to get started using Decipher text message. We look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.